In this video lecture, I am going to discuss what how to convert decimal to double in csof.net. So let's see. So first here, let's take uh, this point decimal. So this is uh, our keyword. So decimal zero times and giving the name of this variable or d1. Then after we need to initialize some values. So let's write here for for the uh, five point giving nine eight zero. Okay, if I give the semicolon, so there is the problems. So if you are using the or decimal, okay, so you need to add the suffix m with the decimal. So let's include here m, then there is no any problems. After that, let's write here decimal giving the name of variable d2 and let's give here 108.89 include m then another or decimal taking and this you are giving the name d3 after that let's write here negative this times minus 98.8 m so three variable of decimal that uh, are created after that we need to convert that so writing here convert to double so uh, for this one first write here double so this is the keyword and double data types and give the object name so let's uh, write here db1 and uh, we need to write here decimal okay decimal dot if you press the dot then or uh, this converted okay so to double so we need to write here to double and passing the variable d1 so with the help of this we can easily convert into the double so decimal has two double methods and this or uh, d1 is now decimal times so after applying this type card string so this converted into double and store into d1 the same thing we can apply with uh, d2 d3 D also so let's uh, include here d2 and this here d3 and the next is here let's give unique name db3 after that it's now converted so the next is we need to print the values so let's write here console class dot right line method and this here we need to print db1 now copy and uh, paste so another is for db2 next is db3 so this is the code to convert decimal to double in csr.net go on this debug click on this start debugging so start debugging then you can see okay so in the double data types you no need to uh, you cannot see m here so this is now decimal 45.980 m and this is now db1 double data types so it's uh, showing only 45.98 okay so when, wherever the m is there with the double data types m is not or there okay so this is the simplest code we can convert or this so decimal to double and now you can notice here 980 m so you can include the zero also with the decimal but uh, in the double data types here you can see or uh, zero is not necessary on the right side okay so this is how we can convert this decimal to double in csr.net so i hope guys this video is the helpful for you so now this video is over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you